Good morning, YouTube. Good morning. Hope you're doing well. All right, we got rain last night in Colorado. Uh, precipitation. We don't get a lot of precipitation here. We don't. We really don't. So, when it happens, I like to film it, and I want to show you what it looks like in the morning after a good rain. Now, instead of announcing to you all moving forward the 30 shots in 30 seconds, I'm just going to give you a little... Just a little facial expression, all right? All right, so then whenever you see that face, you know it's, you better buckle up, buckle up. All right, so. I just did the afternoon work at the Bob. Nice little spot to hang out in Denver. All right, <laughs> it's cold. I just put my jacket on. Come on, Denver. Denver, pull it together. It's almost June. Oh, man, it's killing me. I got my long pants on. All right, gonna do some paint scraping before the boys get home and before date night. Um, as you saw in yesterday's vlog, check that out. We went and got some paint samples, so we're getting closer to painting this here house right here. And um, what else about the paint? Well, I guess if you have any tips, I think I've already asked this like three months ago, but if you have any tips for painting a house, let me know. Because um, I'm just going for it. Of course, there's YouTube. You can watch YouTube videos. But um, all in all, I'm relying on you guys. You guys teach me your ways in the painting world. <sighs> I remember, I can't help myself. Remember I did the uh, paint thinner and I, I burned myself in that vlog. Check that out. It's called uh, Chemical Burn something something. Well, it worked. Like it took a little while, but the paint really peeled well in the bad area. So it is just coming off, coming off like a sunburn. <laughs> Excessive, but uh, I'm gonna try and sand some of the side of the house. I don't think I've ever seen anybody else do this. Speaking of uh, tips for painting, have you ever seen anybody sand the paint? So I'm scraping a lot, and it's coming off. But obviously, you can't scrape your like every single piece of paint off your house. You just do your best to get the big pieces. It's looking okay, but it's kind of. <laughs> spotty so i'm gonna try and sand and this is a sander i bought from ace thank you ace hardware ace is the place for the local hardware store something like that um. Love is getting ready for date night. I'm watering the grass trying to shoot a rainbow for you through the sprinkler. Can you even see that? I don't think you can. Oh, there it is. There it is. <laughs> We're doing well. It's a beautiful day. It was How are a beautiful you? day. It was a, be it was a beautiful day out. It was a be beautiful day. I love Tuesdays. I just read a comment from Damien. What did he say? 
that you love brings so much joy oh. to the vlog. Oh. Yes, Damien, she does. Damien, that was sweet. Thank yes, she you. Does. I, so. I have a very blessed life. I have a very great life, and I am overjoyed. Just today, just was taking a boy. The boys were, I was giving them a bath. Nana comes over every Tuesday for date night. How lucky are we? And Joseph said to me, boy, mama, we sure are lucky. Not everyone has a Nana. Not everyone oh. has a Nana. And I said, that's right, pumpkin. And not everyone has a Nana who lives this close. My mom lives 1,600 miles away in Chicago. So bottom line is life is good. And it's important to recognize all the amazing gifts and great things. Doesn't mean there's not hardships and crosses and difficulties. Right. But. Like I just found a YouTuber that comments on the vlog uh -huh. and I've never watched his videos okay. and Andrew no his son has a oh, dis disease oh. you know or like a muscular disease Andrew would, you know and so it's like there's, your little man oh, there's suffer. oh so we're you know you just count your blessings yeah and then I'm com we complain when our kids disobey that's the perspective but this about perspective. this father made with his son what was his name? Landon. I think his son's name okay. was Landon. And um, they made like a model truck together today. Aww. But the son, you know, just was. So anyway, go check out Andrew's I'll channel check it out. right now. Up there, upper right hand corner. Go check it out yeah. and watch him make a model truck anyway. Good. What a good father. Ooh. Good father, Andrew. Oh, great father. Great father. I just pulled father, over. Father. I just pulled over because I realized I don't know oh. where we're going. Well, you, where? I don't know. I think there's one in Littleton and one in Highlands Ranch. Okay. Here we go. Outback Steakhouse. Got a coupon. Oh. And, they're, and they're doing a special. Here you go. You can oh, show yeah. it to them. Oh boy. Here oh, it is. Boy. Boom. Let's see. Five dollars off. Five dollars off and they're running a special right now about steak and salad and soup and dessert for 15 bucks. We love steak, as you we all love know. Steak, <laughs> yeah, it's my favorite food. Hun, so great job. Great yeah. day. You this came in our free newspaper. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> We did not order the newspaper on Two Sundays. Two entrees. Can we set a standard? What's ten? So I'll, I'll I'll help. Okay. I'm going with a five. Oh. Oh. They didn't bring me my steak sauce. Oh, they didn't. <laughs> like th three minutes. <laughs> I had to wait three minutes for my steak sauce. Can you believe that? So I'm giving out back a five. But here's why I'm giving them a five. Not because of the food. Okay. The lighting. Oh, Compared to Longhorn, yeah. So this building was probably built in the '90s, and I'm telling you, they just didn't understand architecture and lighting in the '90s. Yeah. They had no clue. They just built it and low. Whereas <laughs> Longhorn was probably built 10 years ago. I'm sorry. The ambiance. I'm sorry. The ambiance. That's it. In a restaurant, for me. Yeah. The ambiance is key. And back to the three-minute thing. It was. It was you know. Five by five. It, what? And it wasn't like. You know how oftentimes, okay, you can wave someone down that's not your person, but there was nobody. Nobody was bringing for, for almost five minutes or so, which honestly, it wasn't like a crazy packed house. Like sometimes Texas Roadhouse is packed. Yeah. But obviously these are first world problems. First world problems. <laughs> anyway. I loved my food. I felt like that deal. It was deal, delicious. Everything I had was really good. So we had a $5 off coupon. Yep. $5. $5 from the Denver Post. <laughs> Free newspaper. Newspaper that keeps showing up. Yep. At our house. At our house. And um, they were running this.